I hear well, you. The toupee is the first. Uh, it's the yeah. first thing. It's the first step to mental illness. To full mental illness. It's the first step of denial because I don't know. There has to be some form of mental illness with the toupee because. How about a how about a yellow angel hair, cotton candy head? How about yeah. that? <laughs> and a spray tan. And a spray well, tan. no, it's not the spray tan. It's actually foundation, and it's not blended well at all. And I don't <laughs> know why. Like it's it's um, easy to I'll blend. I'll tell you foundation. why, Tracy. When you piss off the gays, that's what happens. <laughs> They're they like, go, no, we got no, you. No, you're good. You're good. Mike go Pitch. out there. Mike Go Pence, out there, you're great. Well, Mike Pence, my, Mike Pence does his makeup. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, come here, Don, before we go well, on. Yeah. You want me to do it again to you? Him and mother. Him. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, Him and mother. That mirage of creeps. Now, there's some mental illness there. When you put on a toupee that you don't think anyone's going to know. Like, Mark yeah, Albert's got to know, right? Four that, and a half foot tie. I mean, women like, fuck bald guys all the t- I mean, it's a thing. It's not, it, it's something, you know, it's funny because my mom said to me recently. Hello? Yeah, Hello? she was like, not recently. <laughs> yeah, but no, it's true though. Cause my mom said to me like, actually, not recently, but like not too long ago. She's like, do you have a thing for bald guys? And I was like, why? And she's like, you've dated a lot of bald guys. I was like, have I? I don't even know if you have a head. Like, I don't, <laughs> I don't, I don't think that we pay attention as much as you think we pay attention. Um, I think that guys with toupees get the toupee for them. Okay. Absolutely. That, yeah. I've never seen a toupee that look well, but look good ever. Hmm. No, no, not at all. And I've never really, I mean, any kind of woman who would be like, I don't want to date me he's bald. Mm. Like, I don't know if like, that's maybe like bottom of the barrel woman. I don't think it's so much that you don't pay attention. I think that you pay attention to what we pay attention to. So like we have this insecurity and we kind of give off the insecurity and then you focus on the insecurity because we're basically telling you, right. We ain't, we ain't shit because of this. Right. And you go, well, you must know you better than I do. And you go, well, you must not be shit. Right. Right. So that, you know, that's when you say people treat you like, you know, that people treat you how you let them. You know? I like bald guys with confidence. Yeah. Well, you like anyone with confidence. The thing is, sometimes bald people. I don't, don't... know how we didn't hit it off, Trace. Yeah. I know. I mean, we're not not, not together. I got. I got. <laughs> we're not not together. I walk around with big dick energy all the time. Big dick. Energy. You know, only... that is. That's all I've ever asked for. <laughs> Little big dick. <laughs> the energy and then delivery after the energy. <laughs> You man school 202 better hear what I've got to say because you won't get it again. I'm not an alpha male. I'm not a beta male either. I'm just a better man. Better man. Better man. Well, put your happiness first because if you don't, they won't.